mask off. Oh, there we go. Three, two. This is Raptors Rundown. A time to chill. Basketball fans, the weather outside is frightful, but the games inside the Scotiabank Arena, absolutely delightful. Like this Friday night, your Toronto Raptors go up against one of the hottest stories in all of the association, the New York Knickerbockers. Also, Hollywood comes to the north, you've heard about it. The super fan himself, Nav Batya, teams up with Cal Penn for his autobiographical movie. Make sure to catch all the information on that, and you know where all the information really lives? inside the Raptors app. And we got lots on tap right now. It's popping, so you make sure you download, you put that on your phone right now. It's Rundown. Raptors fans, join Coors Light and me at the ballroom in downtown Toronto, December 14th for Raptors versus Nets. Rundown and bowling and chill. Okay, so I know you recognize this hallway. This is the infamous fashion strip, the runway, the catwalk, as the Toronto Raptors know it. This is where, of course, my guy Sohail and the rest of the social team, like Tristan, catch all those fly fits each and every home game day. And um, we're gonna do a breakdown of some of our favorite fits, but first I gotta go talk to the guys. Let me just check in really quick. Uh, it's my Presto Pass doesn't work. All right, so look number one is Fred Van Vliet channeling Squid Game, the ski mask. I'm loving it. Channeling ski mask away, 50 cent. I'm gonna give this fit a nine because I'm a big sci-fi TV guy and I think uh, he probably watched Squid Game and that comforts me knowing that you know at some point we're both watching the same show. Shouts out to this bright spot of sunshine that is Pascal Siakam. Now, Pascal came with the full yellow glow. Watch this, he's got a matching beverage to go with the jacket pant combo. I feel like he's now entered the realm of Toronto fashion icon, along with the likes of OG Anunobi, who has some solid scarf game, as we all already know. Big love to my guy, Scotty Beam, because of course, Winter Blues relevant right now, but he really took Winter Blues to a whole new level. I love the combo with the chain on top, got that like Migos vibe, but he didn't overdo it with too many chains. I like how he, Kind of flipped it with the headscarf, going with like the old auntie vibe. I'm giving Scotty a 10 out of 10 on this look. And who's your jeweler? Big Cat, Adrian. Nope, no one's letting me in. Anyways, still to come, more fashion breakdowns. The next time I do this, I'm gonna do a full breakdown of the fashion choices of one young Gary Trent Jr. That should take about 45 minutes. But right now, we gotta check in on who takes the most time and is the most meticulous in that barber chair when nice in their lineup and getting their fade right. And for that, I go to my boy Josh. Josh, who's the worst in the chair? Or the best, you tell me. So the question is, who's the most meticulous with their hair on the Raptors? To be honest with you, all the guys are cool and trust me with the Clippers. I gotta give a shout out though to former Toronto Raptor, Jalen Rose for having one of the freshest lineups in the game. Also shout out to Scotty Barnes for coming through to check me for a fade. 